All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here. I want to show you how to install Light Show Pi on uh, the newest uh, operating system from the uh, RaspberryPi.org website, which is, uh, I believe, Buster. Uh, now, when we install this, we might run across some errors with the install, but uh, I'll show you how to, we can get around that and get this thing up and running. So, I'm just going to do the install. I'm not going to test no lights, no nothing like this, like that. This is just mainly how to get this on the OS. So, I already went ahead and did an update upgrade and rebooted the Pi to save some time. So, now we're just going to make sure that Git Core is on here. <coughs> Then we're going to go ahead and clone the repository that's on the Light Show website. Then we are going to get into the directory. Then we'll just run this uh, git command here. <coughs> Gotta love window update. Window notification crap. All right, so we'll just clear that. So now we can run the next command. Now we're going to install this. Now more than likely it's going to fail at the software swig swig wig the uh, swig 2.0 so i'll show you how to fix that when we get there and uh more than likely it's going to fail at wiring pi uh <clears throat> for some reason it fails installing that but uh we're going to get around that and install it without using the install sh command here so as you can see it's starting to install some stuff now i'm running the desktop version of buster uh, not the light version this is the desktop version so hopefully things won't take too long so i'm going to go ahead and pause this and uh, I'll be back here in a second. All right, so as you could see, it uh, failed installing the 2.0. So I went ahead and just opened up another terminal here. So what we gotta do is in order to fix this, we need to CD back into the directory here, get get into the uh, install scripts. So we'll get into here. So if we do an LS, as you can see, we have a couple different uh, files here. So we're just going to get into the Raspbian one. And if you scroll down, just a few lines you will see that the 2.2.0 2 .2 so we just need to change that to a 3.0 then just do an XY enter and now that that's fixed we will rerun the package the install <coughs> and uh, let it do its thing so I'll be back when it fails more than likely at the wiring pie and I'll show you how to uh, get around that and fix that problem so stay tuned we'll be right back all right as you could see it failed to install wiring pie so obviously the install SH isn't working right 
So what we are going to do is we are going to remove the wearing pie that is on here. So we'll just go ahead and purge this. So what we are going to do now is CD back into Lightshow Pi. <clears throat> and we are going to go into the install.sh file. Now, let me make this bigger. Now that we're in here, we're going to scroll down. And as soon as I find this, there it is. We are going to put a hash on each one of these because we want it to skip this. So we'll just uh, make yours look like this. Then do a control X, Y, enter to save. And now what we are going to do, we're going to install uh, Wiring Pi using PIB. So we are just going to install it going down this route. Now that it's done, we can rerun the uh, install command one more time. So I'll be right back. All right, so we should be getting to the end of this install. So if all goes well, uh, we should be good to go. All right, sweet. It says all done, so it's successfully installed. And uh, if we just do a sudo, if I get on the right screen, reboot, let that restart, then I'll get the command here to uh, test this out. So we'll just run the uh, flash command off the uh, Lightshow Pi uh, website just to verify that it's uh, the GPIO pins are closing. So we'll log back in here. CD in here, clear that, <clears throat> and there we go, so it's working so far, I don't have nothing hooked up to it, to the Pi or nothing, no relays or anything like that, but I uh, just wanted to prove that the command works with error free, so uh Hopefully this helps out, and uh, thanks for watching, and uh, stay tuned for another one. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up.